Hey everyone, I'm Heather and welcome back to my channel. So we are back today with Disney Dreamlight Valley. In the last one we finished Mushu's first quest, but we are on level four so we can go ahead and start his next one. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, let's see. Bunch of that stuff. Okay. I actually have a decent number of fish here. So let's go ahead and put stuff away. Yeah, I definitely need to do some of that elsewhere. I don't even know where I have those. I guess it's in... Maybe this one? Oh, I guess those are... Is it this stuff? No, it wasn't. It was this one. Although I don't know if I'd like to fill that up with extras of things. So we'll sell those. And apparently we had far too many tuna to get transferred over. Okay. All right, Mushu, right here. Where is this thing? There it is. There's Mushu, come here. Being Let's get this show on the road! Hey, just who I was hoping to see. I'm back in the At Valley Guardian game. And I know exactly who I want to help first. You ready for it? Who do you want to help? The Beast. I have never seen anyone that big try to make themselves so small, metaphorically speaking. How do you want to help him? I thought she'd never ask. Huh. When I try to talk oh. to him, he won't look me in the eye. Plus, he's always mumbling. I get the feeling he lacks self-confidence, which just breaks my little dragon heart. And that's why I want no yeah! me him to be the first participant in M U S H U. That stands for Mighty Universal Self Help Unit. A special program I've invented to help villagers through analysis, action, and immersion. Uh analysis? Huh. The yeah. first step in the program, try to understand the one you're helping by figuring out what they're going through. Action. Action is step two. We take what we have learned about our subject and find actions they can do to get them feeling better right away. Immersion. By the time we reach step three, immersion, we know what's going on with our friend, and we've helped them feel better, at least a little. Then it's time to really dig in to see what's going on. So I'll talk to the beast. Great. I think he knows I'm on to him because he's been avoiding me. Oh, you and me doing guarding things together. I love it. Oh, no. I'm late for my chore. Okay, hopefully. Okay, good. With the quest, it does wake them up, which is nice. Because I was a little nervous. And I don't think it was like that originally. So you had to wait for them. But the beast sleeps late. So it's nice that they wake them up and move them around come for quests. Here. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, beast. Um, please, come here. You look very serious. I suppose I am serious. I'm sorry if that bothers you. I'm just making conversation. Can I talk to you about something? You know Mushu, right? He wants to help build your confidence. He wants to help me? How? Why? I thought opening my greenhouse helped the village accept me. 
I think Lucy wants to help you accept yourself. He's got some kind of program that he thinks will help. Uh -huh. I don't know. That makes me nervous. Would it help if I do Mushu's program with you? We can go through it together. That would make me more comfortable. Hmm. Tell Mushu I will accept his help. Please. I thank you. This is uh, Okay, check back. Nice. Mushu, come here. Come here, Mushu. Mushu, stop running. Stop running. Let's get this show on the road. Oh, yeah. I can tell by your smiling face. The beast said yes. There's one catch. I have to do the program with him. That's the only way he would agree. I sent you to convince the beast, and you come back offering a two-for-one? This is my lucky day. Where do we start? All oh, right. I do love that go get him attitude. The first phase <laughs> of the program is analysis. Ah. To help the beast, I need to know what's on his <laughs> mind. Okay, and to okay. do that, we're going to use an ink blot test. I found a whole book about making and analyzing them in Merlin's library. So I'm pretty much an expert now. We're going to need art supplies. Can you talk to Mulan to get some paper and ask Belle for some ink? We need the good stuff. This is a serious operation. <laughs> Gotta say, there's some nice folks around here. Okay, well, let's hang out with you. <laughs> so we need Belle and Mulan... We're going to keep him with us, though. I thought Belle was here. Oh, she is. She's just right on the other side. Just sitting where I can't see her. Okay. I'd love to spend some time with you. Bonjour, Heather. It's nice to see you. I'm working on a new story. It's the second part of a previous one. A fairy tale adventure about a young woman who's turned into a creature when she's scratched by enchanted thorns. But I'm afraid I don't know where her adventure should take her next. How about... Um, an adventure at sea. What a wonderful idea. Oh. I can already imagine a mighty storm. Perhaps a shipwreck? Oh, but you didn't come to see me just to discuss my story. How can I help you? Do you have any ink I could borrow? Mushu and I are helping the beast with something. Of course, I have plenty. Please take some. Thanks, Belle. Good luck with your story. So if we had said, uh, I don't care about your story, Belle, give me ink, would um, we have gotten ink? Ah, now this is an island I can spend some time on. Hey, Milan, do you have any nice paper? Mushu and I need it for an activity with the beast. It's about Mushu's plan to help the beast become more confident. Yep, for the ink blots. Ink blots? Musha did say something about pictures that open your mind. I guess that's what he meant. Here, you can use this paper. I wish you luck. This village is different, but it reminds me of home, too. <laughs> yes, it's just what we need to start the M-U-S-H-U -S program with the beast. Uh -huh. Now uh -huh. it's time to make some masterpieces. And by masterpieces, I mean ink blot tests. Heather, open up yours open yours up and have a look. Oh no, I'm late for my chores. Wait, what do you see? Do I have chores here? Uh huh. Okay, uh -huh. Heather, now that you've looked at your ink blot test, tell me, what did the ink on the paper look like to you? Um, none of those will look like a spider. A universe of total chaos. Hmm, hmm. that tells me you feel kind of uncertain about your direction in life. I'm so glad. Aren't we, we all? <laughs> Not me, but it seems to be pretty common with you mortal types. <laughs> Don't worry, funny. seeing the chaos means this probably won't take you su by surprise. Now that you've done your ink blot test, it's time for the beast to take his. Will you set it up near his house? Castle? Castle house? You know what I mean. Okay. I've made so many good friends here. So what does he want? 
for his gifts today. We're having that moment. Okay. Sometimes it messes up and it does not work Good with morning. the um, controller like it should. But it usually comes back. It's not doing it today. Oh, that's annoying. Ah, uh, that's annoying. Peridot, yellow bird of paradise, and copper. Okay. I hope that's not a problem for every menu today. Okay, so Oh you poor unfortunate. He has soul. to come this way, I guess. Yeah, here he comes. So we have to listen to them talk about the ink blot test. Hey beast. Real quick, take a look at that sign there and tell me what you see. Destruction. Oh no! I'm late for my chores. No. Wait. Do I Wait. have chores here? Shame and guilt. An empty room where you only where your only company is shadows. That can't be right. Ugh! Listen to me. I'm a fool. Whoa. Okay. Um. Don't worry. It's just some silly splashes of ink on a paper. In fact, I think that might just be a spilled tea. How'd that get there? Hey, you go ahead and relax. We'll be back real soon with step two, which will definitely make you feel better. So that was... Uh huh. What do you think? I think the beast really needs our help. Huh. And fast. I oh. knew there was something going on with him. Huh. We gotta boost the beast's uh, confidence, huh. and a pep talk isn't going to do it. You know, sometimes when Mulan isn't feeling her best, she does some training. Says it lifts her mood and makes her feel all powerful and calm. I can't see the beast doing Tai Chi. I think I'm thinking step aerobics. What do you have in mind? What if we put together an area where the two of you can go and just break stuff? The only time he uses his strength now is when he's angry and out of control, right? But if the beast uses his strength in a controlled way and lets off some steam, maybe he won't be so mad at himself. And that's step two of the MUSHU program. Action. Taking physical action to help ourselves feel better. Let's set up a wrecking area for you and the beast. And we can use the old furniture I found. It's already a little broken, so it's perfect for smashing up. We'll catch up later. Okay. So, place the old furniture near Beast Castle. We'll go ahead and do it behind. Oh, it's not counting one of them. Okay. Maybe, oh. Maybe that one. It's a little bit further away. Okay. Where'd he go? All the way down here already. Mother knows best. I need a thing. Don't forget, dear. <clears throat> hey, Beast. Mushu says we're ready for phase two of his program. What is it? It's something to help you celebrate your strength. Celebrate my... But how can that... <sighs> I suppose I did give Mushu my word. 
All right, lead the way. Oh, Thank the you. valley is coming along nicely. This is very nice. Okay. How do we destroy some furniture? Do I have to use like a pickaxe or something? I'm not sure I should do this. I did it, you can too. Come on, Mushu set this up just for you and me. Won't it feel good to use your strength on purpose? <gasps> Perhaps. I actually do feel better. I never thought of my power as an asset before, only something that made me dangerous. See, there you go. Please tell Mushu I'm ready to continue. I've never seen a kingdom like this before. Mushu, I'm back. I think your plan is actually working. Actually, please, of course it's working. I'm just that good. The Beast says he's ready for the next part of the program. On to the finale, Immersion. I've been waiting for this one. While you were wrecking that furniture with the Beast, I was making the rounds for supplies. Could you go talk to Daisy and Stitch and see if they've got the things I've asked them for? Oh, and we're going to need some of His Highness's royal attire. You probably have to head back to the Beast's homeland to find some of that. Okay. I'm on it. Once you've got everything, go to the crafting station to put our little project together and place it outside the beast's house. The beast is going to have too much outside his house. I'm going to see if there's anything we can recycle from the broken furniture. Good morning. Okay. Something from Daisy. Daisy, Daisy. There's Stitch. Hello. Stitch finished drawing of Beast's face. You drew the Beast's face? Not too sure what this is for, but maybe whatever Daisy has for me will make it a little clearer. Taka, Stitch. Ooh. Yay, Heather talk like Stitch. Taka, Taka. Thank okay. you. Find Daisy. There she is. And we'll stop in to try to get our Pyridot and whatever oh, else you. we needed. Oh, Heather, you're here for Mushu's mannequin order, I bet? Mushu ordered a mannequin? I was confused too, believe me. I tried to get him to tell me what it was for, but he won't budge. So she gave me a drawing of the beast's face. I think I know what Mushu is up to. Well, when you're done with whatever it is, will you come back and tell me? I've just got to know. Here you go. My neighbors are fabulous. Okay. So he wanted a peridot. I have so many of those, I need to probably sell them. But at the moment, we're not too full on that. Do I have a yellow bird of paradise? I don't. He may not get that today. You though. are in the presence of a legend! You know that, right? Copper. Ha <laughs> uh, ha! So Mulan's pretty uh, famous. Yeah. Oh yeah, everyone knows Mulan. Gotcha. She's famous across all of China now. But I'll let you in on a little-known fact. I'm pretty much the secret to her success. How do you help her? Uh -huh. Well, I uh -huh. give her invaluable advice. And when she first joined the army, I made her breakfast every morning. <laughs> Gotta start the day right with lots of protein. <laughs> and I like to add a little smile in face just to brighten her day. <laughs> we are looking for... It's not in that. Is it in this one? If 
I may not have any. Oh, I do. I have a little bit. Well, look who it is! You just say the word! Okay, let's get out of here. We'll go to Beast's Realm. Became the Beast. You know, we did find all those stories that just were, like, laying around that never became anything. Okay, craft a beastly mannequin. And then we'll go back to Beast House and put it up there. Hopefully he's not asleep because I see him hanging out in his house. Okay. There. Is that a statue of me? Mushu, what is this? I'm not Mushu, I'm the beast. And I deserve to be cursed forever. Hmm. Nobody should be allowed to learn from their mistakes. Or grow, or change. I don't believe that. And I, the beast, haven't made new friends, and I don't care about anyone. I'm selfish, selfish, selfish. That's not true. There's Belle and Heather and the others here. I care for them a great deal. Why would you talk about yourself this way? Oh, I... I think I understand this lesson. Phew, that was a doozy, huh? I think we really had a breakthrough with him. That big guy's gonna be alright. You're a good guardian, Mushu. Oh, I'm not done yet. After a tough session like that, I think the beast could use something warm and satisfying. Could you cook up a few bowls of wonton soup? I know Mulan always finds it comforting. I think he will, too. Here, this is Grandmother Fa's special recipe. While you make that, I'm going to check on the, be on the big guy. You know, have a little heart-to-heart -heart chat. And remember, don't be a stranger. Okay, wonton soup. Hopefully, oh, I have everything. Oh, I just everything. know we're going to be good friends. Shouldn't require any of the meat, I would think, because the um. Mulan update doesn't have anything to do with the other update. Would that be considered appetizer? I do kind of wish at this point we could search for recipes. Because even if you know what area they're in, there's a lot of them to run through. Oh, 
Okay, he's a shrimp. Yeah! That's good. Hey Heather, thanks. I'm gonna bring this bowl to Mulan. It's one of her favorites. I wouldn't you eat it with the beast? That seems so weird. Okay, where's the beast? Oh. Well, I mean he's coming this way, so by the time we walk up this way. Can I get a little help here? He'll be on the way. And then he changed course, so I could have just teleported. It looked like he was coming over the bridge. I need a favor. <clears throat> what is this? It smells delicious. Wonton soup, Mulan's grandmother's recipe. Thank you, Heather. If I have friends like you, Bell and Mushu, who treat me with kindness, that's a very good sign that I should try to treat myself with kindness as well. So proud of you. I thank you. That means a great deal. I want Bell to be happy. Review the Mushu program. What did I tell you, Heather? The M-U-S-H-U program is brilliant, right? Oh, I think we yeah! helped the beast find some real happiness with himself. <laughs> sure, I got more work to do with him, but this is a great start. And none of it would have been possible without me. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. You were a huge help. <laughs> you know what, Heather? That's you got funny. the makings of a great guardian. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we finished that. We need to get up to level 7 for that. So let's see what we've got here. More tuna. Okay. So let's go back down here and fish for tuna. And of course it's all gold and blue when I don't need gold and blue. But I only need three tunas, I think. And that's not tuna. Why are they all blue? I've never seen so many blue bubbles at once. And now I'm not getting tuna. I don't think it's a time of day thing. Isn't what I want at all. Okay, nothing out there. So we're gonna have to go through all these blue bubbles to try to get white bubbles. Give me tuna. Oh, come on! 
tuna. And those haven't respawned. I was doing so well on the tuna last time. Maybe he'll at least get a level. Because I did not go look for Birds of Paradise for him. And now they're not even respawning. I think the Forgotten Lands also has tuna, possibly. I think it's them. Oh, we're having a problem with this today. There it goes. I don't know what that was about. Yeah, Forgotten Lands. Well, they only have two fishing spots, which is why I hardly ever go up here. For that. And of course, it's gold bubble anyway. The fish are not good to me today. Keep believing in yourself, and wonderful things are sure to happen. <sighs> okay. Well, I don't have much longer left anyway, so let's go here. And we'll check in the Can store. Can I get a little help here? Okay, let's see what we've got. Oh, there it is. Ha. Hi, folks. Uh, Good nice day to you. I oh, oh, I have almost no money today. Uh, were... Let's see if there's something I have to have up here. I'm sure we already have that. Uh huh. <laughs> Hello. Hi. I feel like I Thank have you to kindly. have that already, but it says I don't. But I feel like I do. Not gonna There's buy the bitch. Christmas rod Ooh, right I just now. Love I guess I should. Uh huh. Hey! Okay. I think that's okay. I know that coat's really expensive. I guess we can get those. <laughs> and I'm definitely going to have to kindly. do the farming soon. Ah. But I guess that's where we're going to go ahead and end this episode. And we'll work on this stuff. I can't believe I get, didn't get a single tuna. Oh, I didn't do this. We'll see what he wanted before I do that. Oh, why are you being that way today? <sighs> Bronze spinach and roasted asparagus. I, I don't really feel like it today.
So we will do that on a different day. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be for everything for this time. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.